Nice. Quick table. Quick table. What a pack we have here. The rare is just a land. We don't really want to set ourselves up for that. So we're looking at the uncommons. Split Skin Doll and Fear of Isolation are both good. <laughs> ah. Gross. Throw it away. Yeah, I wish I could. Like, Judge, can I get a new pack? Do we want the blue flying creature or do we want the white creature that draws cards? Like that's that's where we're at. It's one of these two. Nothing else in this pack says take me. I kind of want to do the nightmare over the toy. Yeah, 2 3 flying for 2 is better than a 2 1 draw card. That's, that's my decision. That's, that's what we're going with. Veteran Survivor can be okay. Aimless Pool is pretty decent. I definitely like the Razorkin Horde Collar. Dusty's great for Delirium. Grand Entryway could go the blue white enchantment route. Although, if I'm going to do that, I should probably pick up a locker room just to draw cards, huh? Blue card, red card. I think we just stick to blue for now. Being able to bounce something and then later draw cards is, is pretty decent. Whoa, come back, bird. We could potentially bounce their one drop and to bounce this back into our hand for turn two. That's That's interesting. I mean, these are rare, and it sets us into the blue-black enchantments. I like that better than I like the survivor. Rat and Ninja Wizard. What a crazy creature type that is. Rat and Ninja Wizard. All right, well, we don't want to get locked out of a good deck, so let's pick up the survivor. That's two survivors in a row. Are you just letting it pick for you over here, my guy? I mean, the Delirium card here can be extremely good. Realize what's the best thing to take here? Flesh Burrower? <laughs> I might take the rare. I don't know that we're going to go that far, but that gives me my set complete on those, so I can play that for standard. I mean, Surgical Suite is really good. Fear of Falling is really good. Is Fear of Falling better than Surgical Suite? I think for our deck it is. Just barely. Survival, draw, white removal. I'm just gonna take the parting here. I'm 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 not liking Nashi. I think we might try to go the uh, Semic deck. Another peer past the veil. Oh my God. Uh, we're not gonna take it because we don't. That was our fourth. That's set complete. So this is just gems at this point. I kind of want a card that we might play. 
That'll let us push the survivor in. So will this. Um, I mean, none of this really, huh? We might play the Teddy just to keep us on curve. Yeah, none of you get played. You don't get played. I mean, not in this deck. Yeah, I think that Enigma Wield too. It's not a highly sought after card. It can be fun, but... I don't know. It's, it's a little rough sometimes. But if I get to play Survivor on three and then make it attack in and draw a card and manifest, it seems really good. I mean, I have no manifest payoffs. I have no enchantment payoffs. We have nothing going for us. Like, we could take the 3-3 three, three flyer. I could take the mana fixing rare land. I think the, the greenhouse, though, is not what we want. Moldering gem is okay but not really where we want to be first picking out of this pack it should be the key bearer or the rare land and honestly i think i'm going to take the rare land on the chance that we get that three four haste survivor that puts counters on lands and then we can have a hexproof land see like optimistic scavenger right now we just pivot into the blue white deck oh it'd be so good yeah we're, we're gonna do that we're, we're not gonna be in the green we're, we're gonna pivot blue white we would get the analyst after that's funny uh, here it is the grand entryway for what I want to be doing though Yeah, we already have a bottomless pool locker room, so I think we go grand entryway Balloon man you're so fun You're not what we are doing though Um, we might play the peeper here just because we've got enough enchantments and rooms going there we go cost reduction on the blue white rooms oh yeah we made a good pivot glimmer burst draw cards make an enchantment trigger your eerie yeah this is going to be a good deck Right, pack two pivot, let's go. We were we were floundering, we weren't doing the blue black thing, we weren't doing the green blue thing. We kinda had half the white blue thing, so let's just start picking up the good white cards. <laughs> you want a glimmer light and a gremlin tamer now. Let's go. Let's let's pack three, open up ghostly dancers and be that deck. That's that's what I want. <laughs> Somebody pass me ghostly dancers. Oh man, the reanimation target there is huge. We want the blue white land though. Vanish from sight is our pick here. Um We don't like any of these. Yeah, fear of immobility. <laughs> Thanks for beating me down. I appreciate it. White is solid in this set. Blue is solid. Green is solid. 
Like there's there's really good colors. There's a lot of fun stuff going on in this set. I mean, we need none of this. I might play a Megalodon, but I doubt it. <laughs> it's just a good top end. We'll see. All right, Sprinter. Oh, uh, we want the vessel here. The eerie on this thing is so good. As much as I would like the exercise or the seized, even threats around every corner would play decently. We want the vessel though. Three two vigilance that dies and makes a flyer. That's that's good. Especially if we can pump more counters on them using the optimistic scavenger or the grand entryway. I mean, there's another exercise, but there's also a second fear of falling. You're both good. I gotta take some removal though. I need I need more interaction, and that's premium removal. I doubt fear comes back, but if it does, man. Yeah, I need removal. Yep, you you right. You right. We, we got a bounce. We got a removal. We got a vanishing. A little bit in the fear. So I mean, we've got some temporary stops, but that's about it there. Holy crap. Um, I kind of want the twins, but I also want the board wipe. Unable to, uh, unable to scream is going to be premium removal in this stack if we can even find it. I think people are picking it over some of the commons and rares or uncommons and rares, though. It's that good in this set. Yeah, no, we're not looking to manifest, really. We'll do the split up. There's a Valgavoth! What is this? There's a Valgavoth? <laughs> oh my god. Our best pick here is Vanish from Sight. Splash Black for this triple black card i think i'm just gonna take him because he's a mythic and i want to play him in standard otherwise like under the skin it would even be a better pick for us than valgavoth there like um i mean it's not really where we want to be playing the calamity prowler but he is a um makes something unblockable he triggers our enchantments if we don't have a reanimation spell for Valgavoth that's funny um, do I want the second land over fear of immobility This is pack three already. Yeah, I want the land. Oh, I was going to take Valgavoth, whether you said to or not. I mean, reluctant role model. Glimmer Seeker would probably be okay, too. Both of these are good for us. I'm going to take the rare, though. Get another card set complete. Uh, anything we're looking for, so we'll take the uncommon for gems. Threats around every corner came back. Man, we might splash that, actually. There is potential for that. Okay, we could take Emerge from the Cocoon. <laughs> I just don't have a way to discard Valgavoth. Otherwise, he might get played in this. The only way we could get him into the graveyard is by manifesting him in there. Uh, the twins came back. Okay. Um, how do 
we doing on creatures? 11. <laughs> He's just staring at me like you know you want to. Like, yes, I do, Valgamoth. I really, really do. I mean, we got a good amount of enchantments. Survivor, coordinated clobbering. Strength might even be okay because it's an enchantment aura. Daggermaw is a emerged target, and honestly, like fear of falling, fear of immobility is an okay retarget. Willing Vessel would be okay. I don't think we want the Enigma. We just did not get enough synergy to make this work. This is going to be another one of those decks. Like having the layer splashing for any of our colors is okay. But it enters tapped. I don't like that. I'm really about to play two chandeliers and a teddy bear to make this duck work. Seventeen lands. Got a lot of flying stuff going on. Scavenger is okay, but we didn't get any of the other really good blue white payoffs. If we splash green, we get strength, survivor, and threats. A three, a three, and a four drop. How many ways did we get to manifest? Three? Four? That's not enough for Valgavoth. This is fun as the idea of manifesting him and emerging him is. Uh, I think we just we just run it where it is, just just like this. These these last couple of drafts I've heard a little bit, and that the decks haven't been very good, but they've been nice in that uh, I've picked up some decent rares for set completion. But yeah, I don't I don't think we want the green splash. There's not enough manifest to even consider getting Valgavoth in there. Don't do anything until turn four. I mean, it's not my favorite hand, but we will keep it. I guess. Alright. I mean, he 
don't have to opponent. You can just land cycle. That'd be cool too. We would. We would. I think we cast the vessel. Island would be really cool. That's too much to ask for. going on 17 lands doing the thing there we no i need another island This is silly, and I should not be doing this. This is silly, and I should not be doing this. Was silly and I should not have been doing that <laughs> I don't know if that was a big brain play that was that was a desperate play that's what that was Play this. Yeah, yeah, you keep looking at my stuff. That's fine. Um, return up to one target creature to its owner's hand. It's an instant. Let's do just that and get some damage in. No blocks. Okay. I'm going to end the turn two then. No blocks. That's fine. Um, yeah, I'll take three. What else are you doing? My turn. All right, well, we're gonna draw cards. We, we want a Glimmer Burst then. Finally, another island. Hmm. I 
No, that's this. Okay, so we're gonna do this. We're gonna cast the bottomless pool. Um, that's fine. Make it go away. Do you want that to be the next thing you draw? I know I wouldn't. Yeah, on bottom. Um, we're gonna hit for three, put them to 12. They're gonna gain two, go to 14. So this can't be cast untapped next turn. But I need an untapped land, don't I? All right, we'll keep it. Oh, that's not gonna help you. It's time to trade it in. I guess I could have taken that damage, been able to abandon. Um, I almost want to go Chandelier first. Another counter spell. All right, well, you have got it, my friend. Is that both of them? No, I've got one more, so that'll be nice. I mean, they gotta do something about this spirit, or they die in two turns anyway. Amazing. You're vigilance, so you'll never tap. Get in for six unblockable, put you to two. Flip it up. I don't even know how we did that. That one's wild. <laughs> it's all because I bounced an island, huh? That was that was a crazy play. Maybe it was big brained. Maybe it was big brained. Oh. That's gonna be like that, huh?
This is a trap, right? I have to mulligan this. There's no way, even though I got the best one drop. I don't have the, the blue for the two drops. Yeah, we have to do that. Um, we're just going to put back the teddy bear. This is Peeper. I almost want to fear of isolation the the twins there. gonna hurt. Get in for that damage while you can. Yeah, lose two life, draw some cards. That's cool. We got it. We got a shot here. We'll start swinging next turn, I think, depending on uh, how this plays out. Bottom this pool. That's fine. What are you gonna kill? The twins? Okay, that's fine. Researcher. Okay. Um. Yeah, you kind of made me need to do this now, didn't you? Do the thing with that touch. That's fine. Swing for four. That's fine. And dies. Okay, and the chandelier is here. That's good. One, we can bottomless pool. We can just get rid of that. I wonder if I go there, we can return this. One little bottomless pool again. 
Right, and you can replay that for your next turn too while you're at it. And control decks are so weird. Fear of immortality, that's fine. Researcher, it's fine. It's not worth it just yet. It's not worth it just yet. Swing with your flying death touch lifelink. Ooh, okay. Okay. Might be wrong. It might might worth be doing. Infinity. Cost five to unlock that. That's so bad. Man, you just have it all, don't you? Zach, what are you doing to me right now? Play the meat locker, tap down the 4 4. Get your swing in. I'm, I'm chumping and I'm chumping. Like. <laughs> the mine skinner? That was gross. That, that's not at all what I want to see this turn, but thank you. Um, where are we at? We're at 20 cards. So, two turns for the unblockable to kill us. We can Glimmer and Ghost and block nothing. That's fun. Yeah, I think we lost. 
They just had the answer, and I could not get anything to stick to the board. Everything played got removed. Amazing. I mean, we can do the things, so we're gonna we're gonna play it. Wow, no hesitation. Just get it out of here. I have to miss a land drop again to do the thing? All right, well. Play it uh, back on white, I guess. Time walk myself. Now you're the player who got to go first. <laughs> really? Pretty good. Pretty good. I gotcha. Oh my god. What? Alright, well, no, we're we're done. That that's that's game. <laughs> Today is just not the day for drafting. Everybody's moved on to alchemy. Jesus. That was fun to watch, says the Boros player. <laughs> if it's good, it's good. Yeah, no, absolutely. That is not good. I mean, that's not really good either. Okay, I knew I built a bad deck, but holy crap. Give me the chance to draw. I'm gonna take my chance to draw.
Why? Why we gotta be like this? Not how I wanted this to go. What else are you doing? What is going on today, man? Everybody just has everything, just the whole way through. Like, ridiculous. Are you planning to kill your own creature? I didn't think so. That was silly. Okay. We might get out of this. Kill your monkey, like no problem. Draw something else. Perfect. <clears throat> what is the play here? I still think I'm supposed to keep you locked down. I'm not worried about the Slayer too much at the moment. Even better. counters on things, will it matter? There's a really good chance at this. We might actually win this one. Swing both. Swing both. Oh, this is not looking good.
This room is insane for Boros. Just draw an extra card. <laughs> okay. Isolation. All right, this this is our play. We're gonna we're gonna settling twins. Let them do whatever. Ghost. So the thing is, is if I blow up, you're gonna kill my Calamity Prowler, right? Like that's that's fine. So we're gonna destroy all untapped creatures. Four, five, six, seven. We need to draw a card to do both next turn. Maybe it's just friendly ghosts then. Friendly ghosts. Leave that out. You get to draw two. You get to tap something down. Glass works. All right. Kill my ghost. That's fine. Are you gonna lock down the twins? That's also fine. You make a 1-1. One, one. Yeah, and this, this, this turn's huge though. Because we're going to get to go Scavenger, Fear, we turn the Rotunda, give the Scavenger 1 plus 1, and I think we grand entry here, yep, counter counter, we'll go here, and here. That was pretty cool. I was thinking about bouncing the twins, but uh, I like that better. If they get the thing that says they win, I'm gonna be a little upset. So we got and a FOMO, huh? Interesting. Turn. 
But if you make fear of missing out unblockable, you swing in for what, four? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Use this to tap that. You've got two more attackers. Let's draw a good card. Glimmer Burst is good, but that is... Mm. One to take five damage and one can't block, so now they get in four. Uh, this is close. I need to live. Yeah. What else do you have? for two. Oh man, I'm glad I blocked the two damage and not the one. Good game, guy. That was so close. So close. By one. Two and two. Man, these games have been dragging. I thought that was like game five. Come on, Arena. It's supposed to be best of one with the hand smoother even, and you're just messing it up. Okay. Flying, like you're a cheerleader. Okay. Can we just take you out of the picture? Oh, 
honestly, that's a really good card for me to have on top. Um, never a reluctant role model or another creature you control dies. If it had counters on it, put those counters onto one target creature. So even if they do kill the role model, we can move it over to the vessel. That's so good. I mean, get the 1-1. One, one. Alright. <laughs> this is what this deck is supposed to look like. <laughs> Something a little more like this. Wicker Thresher. Reluctant role model is just going to win this game single handedly, huh? No, my enchantment. Let's draw a card. You and me, opponent. It's not what I wanted to see. This is kind of shitty because I want to use it to blow that up. But if I do that, they're definitely blocking. I mean, they have to block. Make a 2 2 flyer. Oh! the unwilling vessel we are at 32 life and now if they kill the reluctant role model he's got seven counters on it that go onto the unwilling vessel Good game. <laughs> All right, three and two. This is even. We need to win one more so that we didn't lose any rank today. You know what? We're done with this stuff. This is how we lose, this is how we lose. This, this is getting out of hand. What is this arena? This is not a curve. It's 
<laughs> That's so bad. Come on. Alright, Mardu, twins. Uh, twins of our own that we can't do anything with. Oh man. Kind of glad we did that. That would have been a beater next turn. So bad. Well, at least we get a board wipe. But we are going to lose two mana screw. Hey! For everyone you don't kill. Oh, I'm blocking. Come on. Keep that board clear. We'll, we'll play a 5-5. Five, five, or a 4-4 four, four flying for 5. You've got removal for it. Okay. an instant that could be good play a prowler probably should have saved my eerie trigger and played the ghost first but right, manifest red This unlocked before I start like fear and swinging, but unlocking that costs so much. That's fine. Do it. Yes. Go ahead, put it back on top. That's exactly what I want. Um, here, I think we unlock. Swing, draw, nice.
It's a shame this is a sorcery. But you are... Oh, seized! I was not expecting that. Exercise. Excellent. Trapped it. Trapped it in the screen, please, opponent. Attack in the box. That is not trapping anything anywhere. Sheltered by ghosts. Okay. Okay. Have removal, so we don't want to. Put all our eggs in one basket, so to speak. That's fine. That is fine, I think. back foot but we're we're trying <laughs> no That's not good. I could get Fear of Falling back. That might be okay. This might be okay. So you're going to gain 8 life back up to 20. That's actually pretty good. Any 
sack it. And then I get that back. And now look who's tapped down. Oh, and let's buff this one. I mean, that's not great, but we get to attack with literally everything and take all those abilities away. Yeah. All right, what else you got, opponent? I'm not out of this. Unless you have a 4-4 four, four haste, make a gremlin. Holy crap, what a game that was. That's a uh, four though, and that puts us right back where we started. <laughs> Arena. I want to play magic today, please and thank you. Board wipe will help us come back from being behind if we get to cast it. If, if is good. Alright, roll model. Don't play anything. Vicious Clown. I really don't like how this is playing out. <laughs> Kill my reluctant role model. Or not. Or not. How much does it do? Three damage. Can kill the scavenger savior of the small okay okay
gonna draw a land. I mean, that doesn't really help you a whole lot. What do I want back? I don't really want any of that back, huh? kill one thing opponent night mayhem okay but why didn't you attack with the five five yeah, I see it. It doesn't have reach. I'm not scared. You're scared. There we go. Richie Poo. Alright. This, this deck has swung back all the way around and made me gain rank today. Even the worst Azorius deck I have drafted is a good deck. Like, man, just blue-white is really good. Cordo Calls. Yeah, we've played a couple of times, buddy. I'm glad to see you're in Mythic. Congratulations. Um... <laughs> awful. Just awful. You would... Oh, really? Well, let's see what happens if I just put it back. Not a whole lot, huh? Alright, well, let's get the thing. I think we want to give it flying first, and then we'll play a peeper. Alright, Court of Calls. Cover ship, okay. My guy, okay. Nah, I don't I don't like that. We're we're just gonna do the thing. Give me back my my thing to manifest. Yeah, that's that's what we're putting down. Fiber Get in. Oh, do it. Do it. You know you want to. Come on, Cord. Okay, what do we tap him down? Interesting. 
interesting. Cracking a land, or you got another color? Glimmer light, huh? What if we just make that go away? Not right now. The living phone. This is so good. This is so good. Okay, so we're just gonna next, and we're gonna choose to attack with both of our creatures. I'll make you do the thing, that's fine. Okay, we ready? Because we're just gonna tap him for mana, and then we're gonna split up and destroy all untapped creatures. That right there is a four for one. Your go. I did see the Toby get put into their hand, but I wasn't going to have another opportunity like that. Yeah, draw and discard, because Toby's not it, is it? <laughs> oh, man. All right, well, we unlock and we attack. Go to four, we draw a card. Even if you kill my four, four, I've got four unblockable damage next turn. Man, and we're not even diamond, we're in platinum. Come on. Oh, you have something? <laughs> and that feels good right there. Hey, Platinum Tier 2. We're halfway through it. Uh, ooh, final boss. And even if we lose this match to final boss, we get to... Uh, we have a little bit of rank protection. I don't think we fall back into plat three right away. I do think it takes a, a game or two. I mean, it's not the best. Let 
least it's just a diamond player this time. Not somebody in Mythic. Alright, Vessel. Amy is fine. for the bit we can. We'll end the turn. Really like maybe another blue mana. Well, that's not how that was supposed to go. Go fear returning the bounce spell. I guess we play a role model. And no attacks, not this time. Let's see what else you got. See what else you have. Limb reversed, all right. It's another island. That means we can do two things. Get that out of here. Uh, flying. And I think we do settle the twins. Oh, fear of falling. Sorry, we have to give up the other thing, but that puts us at what? Eight flying next turn? Okay. Do you think it's just turn this face up and swing? Swing. Let me click the button. Fine. Okay. You're digging. Are you going to do the Drowner, or are you going to vanish from sight? Vanish from sight, the role model is good, but I do think they need to flood pits. They can't really do both. 
they might have to get rid of the role model now. Or not. So, what if we just exile that? What? We did it with this deck. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Holy crap. Those first two losses were so intense. That's seven wins, though. Seven wins, two losses. Look at this thing. This is not at all a good Azorius deck. But man, did it get there off of our three drops, huh? The split up and the unwilling vessel, I feel like were the two cards that did the most work in this.